Number 79. Which atom and or ion is or are isoelectronic with Br plus Sc2 plus Se As minus Kr Ga3 plus or Cl minus? Okie dokie. So, new word here, right? Isoelectronic. What does that mean? If atoms or ions are isoelectronic with each other, that means they have the same electron, I'm just going to put E minus, they have the same electron configuration. Or at least that's what they say in the textbook. But there's an easier way of memorizing this. If you have the same electron configuration, chances are you will have the same amount of electrons. And that, I think, is the easier method of memorizing isoelectronic. Iso, we've seen this before when talking about isotopes. Iso means same in chemistry. In this case, they're talking about electron. So there it is. It's right in the word, right? Same amount of electrons. And now they're asking for which ones are isoelectronic with Br plus. So let's just find out how many electrons Br plus has. So remember, plus means that you actually lost electrons. And if you're a minus charge, you actually gained electrons because electrons are negative. So if you become more negative, you gain electrons. If you become more positive, you lose electrons. And how do we find the amount of electrons? Remember, the atomic number is equal to the number of protons, which equals the number of electrons. And I'll put a number of protons, which equals the number of electrons if no charge. So that's like your starting point. You always get the atomic number. That's the number of electrons. And then if there's a charge, you just manipulate it from there. So bromine is over here. The atomic number of bromine was 35. So 35, but now it's telling me that it's a plus and there's no number here. So we assume that it's a plus one. So plus one means that we lost one electron. So 35 minus one is 34. Now we just got to find out out of these six, which one has the same amount of electrons as Br plus. So let's start with the first one, Se2 plus. So start with your um, atomic number, right? Selenium is right here. Selenium had an atomic number of 34. So that's 34. And now they're saying that, uh, selenium is a plus two, which means that you lost two electrons. So 34 minus two is 32. So this would not be isoelectronic with bromine plus one because 34 is not the same as 32. So we can get rid of this one right here. Next one, Se. Well, this one has no charge. This is just an atom. And selenium, just by itself, is just 34 electrons because protons equals electrons. So this one would be isoelectronic with Br plus one. So we could circle this one. Next, As minus one. Um, arsenic is right here, and arsenic has an atomic number of 33, and now it's telling us that it's a plus one, uh, sorry, a minus one charge, which means that you gained one electron. So 33 plus one is 34 electrons, and that's isoelectronic with what we want to be, because Br plus has 34 electrons. So As minus one is also another ion that's isoelectronic with Br+. plus. So circle that one. Let's do krypton, Kr. Krypton is over here. This has a atomic number of 36. Sorry, I kind of like circled it out, but chrome, uh, krypton has a atomic number of 36. This is not a ion. It's just an atom. So 36 does not equal 34 because we want it to be 34. So we could cancel out krypton. Now let's move to uh, Ga, gallium. I'll just put it over here. Ga3 plus. Gallium is over here. Atomic number of gallium is 31. 3 plus means that we lost three electrons. So 31 minus 3 is 28.
eight electrons. And that's not 34, so that's out. And then last but not least, I'll put chlorine over here, Cl minus one. Chlorine is right up at top here, which is 17 electrons in the beginning because protons equal electrons, atomic number, right? And now it's minus one, so that's a gain of one electron. So plus one, so that's 18. And definitely not, right? Bromine plus one had 34 electrons. This one has only 18, so that's out. And that's your final answer. So there's only two atoms and ions here that are isoelectronic with Br+. It was the selenium, that's the atom, no charge. And then the ion was As minus one, arsenic minus one. Because they all had the same electron configuration, same amount of electrons, and that's that. So, guys, we're done with this one. You could check this one off, give it a big, big nice check. Um, thanks so much for tuning in. Hopefully this helped. Let me know in the comments what you think. Love to hear from you guys. Have an awesome day. Keep studying hard for your quizzes, tests. Let me know how you're doing in the class. And I'll see you guys all in number 80. We're almost at the end of chapter three. It's, feel like it's been forever, right? But I'll see, I'll see you. I'll see you. All right. Bye-bye.